Hey guys, this is Tofan. Today I'm gonna make a special video for you guys. Today I wanted to show you what coin wrappers I use for my coin roll hunting. So, um, I'll start off with my safe for my coins. I got the Heritage Security products. Uh, you can use the key, which definitely can't lock pick. There's your own code, which I won't show you, but you just push the buttons in a sequence. Like for example, if my code was this, you just do that. You put it in your sequence, or you can use your RFID tag and you can scan it on there. What I think the most effective is using this, so. Type in the code and it opens. And there's some space with a cushion pad. So this is a really expensive safe, $100, I guess. I just got it as a gift, so. And here's my tubes. I bought these for 50 of these for $23 or something on Amazon. This is for quarters, dimes, pennies, nickels, and half dollars. These I had originally had. I had three of those. I use one now. Let's talk about my, I just bought this from Harbor Freight for the shits of it. <laughs> this is a, uh, one of these, uh, these, it's, it was $12. Oh shit, I think I broke this. No, no. It's broken. Uh, this is, uh, operates. Oh, shit. Alright, I'm gonna put you down for a second while I straighten this thing out. Is that this motherfucker? Okay, I, I think it should be good. Um. So this was $12. This runs on two C batteries. Um. This is the Money Miser coin sorter. It does not do good at nickels, but everything else, pennies, dimes, and quarters, it does decently. You can put all your change in here. And you just turn it on. Really good for 12 bucks. I mean, it speeds up the process of rolling up, especially when it works best with crimp dents. I have some of my, uh, I, I first, my first coin wrappers were these, uh, um, from Walmart. These are the 10 plus gear, 25 of each denomination, well, four denominations, you know, pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters, crimp ends, 267 a box, or about two of them, and, um, I used up almost all the nick, um, those, and then those are some of the quarters. I use this box, actually, as my, uh. I used to use this as my cash box and all my change, but I, I put every single penny I have into my bank so I could buy half of that I got called. So um, I'll give you a demo of this. Well, I don't have any coins to demo, but pretty much you put your paper wrapper of each denomination. They provide you with one the Harrisburg rolls. Um, so just for, but yeah, you just turn this on, you put all the coins and it magically sorts it, I guess. So back here I have some of the crimped end quarter. Oh, I have some of those two by twos. The uh, I don't really use them anymore. But I got like a pack of 25, 20 of each nomination. I or twenty five. I forgot what it was. I use these tubes now because they're just nicer. It's like it's just I like you can touch the coin. So I don't use two by twos. Um, uh, and I have my inventory sheet of. Well, I don't really need it, but. Um, We'll talk about this in a second. So I have 11 of the penny uh, crimped ends uh, just laying here. I have some nickel. I have 26 nickel wrappers uh, crimped ends. I have like five or seven dimes because I just did a huge hunt for dimes. I didn't get anything. but I have se um, some of the uh, Harrisburg crimped ends because I didn't use those. I bought like a bag of them from Dollar Tree to roll up some coins like a few years back. Here is some of the... Uh, Pen plus gear assorted coin wrappers. These right there. So I put some in the bottom. So I use this pretty much as my coin tray. Now these is something we need to talk about. Free coin wrappers. You can get these at any bank. Tomorrow I'm going to bank hop. I'm hunt buying copping six banks in Fuquay. Oh shit. Did I really just give away my motherfucking location? Man. Now all y'all motherfuckers gonna come over here and start stealing all my coins. Anyway, I'm gonna do it on uh, tomorrow. So I got the uh, 10 of the, uh, I got these all from Wells Fargo, just for like free, free time. <laughs> I picked up some of the dollar, the small dollar coin wrappers, just I got 10 of them, just in case. I'm probably more likely to use the Eisenhower wrappers, I don't have any of those, but I'm gonna bank hop for those as well. 
Now they gave me ten of the half wrappers until I ordered a box of them. We'll get to them. So these are they give them for free. I'm not kidding. I got two of the times I went to the bank. They gave me these for free, like twenty. Then so I got like fifty dime wrappers. Let me check how many I got actually. I'm using this flashlight because this is in my closet. Forty-seven. I have forty-seven. Um, so they gave me these for free. So literally, that's almost a box of dimes right there for free printed. Not a penny. Now you may be saying, well, these are a pain in the ass to use. Well, I know, but you can't be free. You can't be free. Um, now here's all my penny wrappers. I got approximately 72 of these, I think. I got, so yeah, I got these for free, just like free times going. Also got a bunch of the nickels, but I don't, I'm not gonna, I'm, now I'm only hunting for pennies and uh, quarter wrappers because... I don't have the uh, box, which we'll get to those in a second, for the pennies and the quarters. Because well, I'm not hunting quarters. Because they're just as you, your guess is as good as mine. They're really not worth it. Because it's really hard to find the silver. I heard that someone hunted 40 boxes. You only got one silver. And that's just a huge waste of time and money. So uh, there's no point in hunting quarters. I'm not going to do it. Don't ask me to. I might just to get rid of those rolls, but... Don't expect me. Now, after I sorted these all out, um, I put all the penny and wrappers in here. So now I have I can hold 50 crimped ends in here, actually. Perfectly 50 uh, crimped ends in this box. So Next, I'll put quarters, because I'm about to do a penny hunt on either Friday night or Saturday. Depending whether I go on a, like a mini trip across North Carolina. Shit. I also gave my ro location again. Because you can just look up. The city I just said, North Carolina, and you're gonna know where I'm talking about. Oh, I don't know. You'll probably know. Anyway, now let's get on to cheap. Uh, what is the best coin wrapper? For convenience, crimped ends. For price, flat uh, wrappers. But let's talk about those really quick. Um, with flat wrappers, uh, well, with crimped ends, they're really convenient, but they're really expensive. Um, now let's talk about bulk. Um, I like to get these in a thousand, a lot of a thousand of these. So if you get a crimped ends, you pay about 17 to 22 bucks for a thousand of them. And they don't make half dollar. Well, they do, but they're like a pack of 40. I mean, like, who's going to pay for five bucks for a fucking pack of those? Um, uh, so yeah, it's flat for half dollars and dollar coins. And the other donations, you can use crimped ends. Um, so here's what I bought. These, uh, they have penny, I'm sorry, nickel, diamond, quarter wrappers. MMF in the Industries on Amazon. So let me show you. We got a thousand of these. You're not going to believe how much I paid. Look, a thousand dime wrappers. Not used them yet. You not believe how cheap these were. These are a $5.98. But you have to get them as them. We're talking pennies, pennies to hunt a box of dimes, nickels, and Dodger denominations. $5.98. You get only 29 cents. Look, these are nickel wrappers. And they, they have a nice space. They take a Another con pro of the uh, fl flat wrappers are... That's how much space it takes. Look, only 50 penny wrappers. Look how much fi 50 penny wrappers take, so... Uh, crimped ends. So that's the... But the only con of them is ease of use. I mean, definitely the crimped ends are much easier. Now, half dollars is a different story. I decided to order these... Uh, so I was able to get uh, for 12 bucks. This box is really big. Um, so uh, for $12.64, I was able to get a thousand wrappers. So we're talking about 76 cents. Here's what they look like. They're really cheap wrappers, but they do the job. So I can hunt my first box of half dollars because I just placed an order and they'll be here next Friday. Hopefully by next Friday. If they're not, you're going to piss me off. You're pissing me off. So we're talking about 70 something cents for the, per box and 20. Now, I might, well, we'll see which um, coin wrapper is easier to use. I mean, so yeah, that's what I used, uh, guys. Uh, so, yeah, this is, um, yeah, I honestly would just stick with the, uh, Pay the flat ends. Plus, you can get them for free. I mean, you can build boxes of these. I mean, once I'm gonna just keep going each bank. If I go 30, if each bank gives me an average of 30, and I hit six banks, that's 180 free wrappers right there. 
Yeah. So yeah, that's really, you can get free wrappers from banks. They give them out to you, no charge. Um, but anyways, thanks for watching. This is Thompson.